Hi everybody, welcome to Live Blogger. In this video, I'll show you how to add this social media share buttons to your WordPress website. So this is how it looks. We can see that we have these different buttons over here. And if I click on any of these buttons, we'll be taken to the share page of that social media. And we can see that we have the title of the website and also the link of the website displayed over here. So we had created this from scratch using HTML, CSS and JavaScript in the previous videos. I will leave the link of the videos in the description of this video. And this is also responsive. So if I decrease the width of the browser window, this is how it will look on smaller screens. So we can see that all these icons are displayed at the bottom of the screen. All right, so let's get started. Here I have logged into my WordPress dashboard and for running this locally, I'm using a software called Local by Flywheel. So this is the app. You can just download it for free from Google and just create a new site over here and just click on start the site. So here I'm using a default theme that comes with WordPress. Now, since this is a custom design, we need to add HTML, CSS and JavaScript code to our website. So for that, we can use a plugin called custom CSS and JS. So just go over here to plugins and click on add new plugin. And here you can just search for custom CSS and JS. And you will find this plugin called simple custom CSS and JS. So just go ahead and install the plugin. And once you install it, you will find this option over here called custom CSS and JS. And here we can add our CSS, JavaScript and HTML code. So first of all, let's add the HTML code. So let's click on add custom HTML. And first of all, let me show you how this website looks right now. So let's click on view site. And this is how this website looks right now. So let's go back and uh, here let's add a title. I just type social share buttons HTML. And uh, here I'll just delete all of this and let's go to our source code. And I will leave the link of the source code in the description of this video. So let's copy this HTML from here. So we'll just copy everything from the start of the social share container division to this toast division. So let's copy all of this and let's paste it over here. And now here we can see we have the SRC of the images. So right now it is set to images forward slash Facebook logo.png. Now we don't have this image inside our WordPress website. So first of all, we need to upload these images. So here we have the images inside the local project. So let's go ahead and click on media. And here let's click on add new media. And here we can go ahead and drag and drop our files. And here we can see we have all these images. So I'll just go ahead and select all these images and I'll just drag and drop them over here. And we can see all the images are uploaded. So now let's go ahead and get the links of these images and let's paste it inside the HTML. So let's click on WhatsApp. And if you scroll down here, we have the file URL. So let's click on copy URL to clipboard. And let's paste it over here for WhatsApp. And now let's go back over here and here let's close this and we have Twitter. So let's copy URL to clipboard and let's paste it for Twitter. And then we have Telegram. So let's copy this and let's paste it for Telegram. And then we have this share button. So let's copy this and let's paste it over here and uh, then lastly we have the facebook button so let's copy this and uh, let's paste it over here and that's it with the html so let's go ahead and click on publish and now let's add the css so let's click on this add css code button or you can also click on add custom css over here and for the title let's type social share buttons css and let's delete this and let's go back to our source code. Let's go to the CSS file. Let's copy all this CSS from here. And let's paste it over here. And everything else will be as it is. And let's click on publish. And lastly, we need to add the JavaScript. So let's click on add JS code. And here for the title, let's tap social share buttons, JS. And let's delete all of this and let's go back to our source code. Let's go to the main.js file and let's copy all this JavaScript from here and let's paste it over here. And here on the right side, we need to change this to footer because here we can see that we are adding the JavaScript inside the footer. 
So let's go ahead and set this to footer and uh, let's go ahead and click on publish. And with that, our code has been added to our WordPress website. So let's go to our website and let's reload this page. And here we can see that our social share buttons are being displayed. And let's go to the mobile version and this is how it will look on mobile version. So everything is working all right. So let's click on one of these uh, buttons. And here we can see that we have uh, the link and also the title of the website displayed over here. Now if you go to any of these posts, for example, if you go to test post and if I click on telegram over here, now we can see that the test post title is displayed over here and we also have the link of the test post displayed over here. And let's also check whether the share button is working. So let's click on the share button and we can see that the link has been copied. So let's paste the link over here and let's test whether it is working. And we can see that the link is indeed working. So that's basically how you can add this custom social share buttons to your WordPress website. All right, so that's basically it for this video. If you have any doubts, you can ask in the comments below and uh, I will leave the link of the source code in the description of this video. So if you like this video, please click on the like button and subscribe to this channel to get the latest video updates. Thanks a lot for watching. Have a nice day.